Hi, this is Sri Ganesh from Dream Chasers. 9941436511. www.dreamchasersindia.com. Today we are going to look at session 3, part 1. Agrarian, relating to land or agriculture. An agrarian society depends on land for the major source of income. Retrospect. Retro means back. Spect means to see. Retrospect means to look back. But look back in terms of time. In retrospect, the buildings could have been constructed in a better way. In retrospect, the bridges should not have been built. Recapitulate. Cap means head. Re means again. Recap means to tell the main points again. From this cap only you get the word capital, head of a state, captain, head of a team. To recapitulate means to tell the main points again, which uh, in shortened form is written as recap. So you will see that after a program is uh, there, they might just recap what has happened, especially in some news or something like that. Cacophony, phone means sound, cacophony means bad sound or noise. The teacher could not shout above the cacophony of voices in the class euphony good sound you means good wherever you have this uh, you it has got something to do with good euphemism is a good way of saying something pass away is a euphemism for dying catastrophe sudden calamity it is not just a calamity it's a sudden calamity earthquake is an example of a catastrophic event Conglomerate, a corporation made up of different companies that operate in diversified fields. For example, you have a group where one of the companies is in information technology space, the other is in power space and so, so on. So the Tata Conglomerate. Aberration, a deviation from normal, a deviation from expected course of action. So suppose a person is a very good boy and he misbehaves or uh, he does something that he doesn't do normally, then we can call it an aberration, adage, a saying, a proverb, a maxim. There is nothing like a free lunch is an adage. Adhesive is something that tends to stick. So glue uh, is an adhesive. Admonish, to correct or caution, especially by giving advice or warning. He admonished him and begged him to abandon his purpose. Admonish your friends privately, but praise them publicly. Similar words, reprove, rebuke, reprimand, reproach. Now, reprimand is sharp and angry criticism. The scientist who tried dangerous experiments was reprimanded by his colleagues. Adversary, opponent. Pete Sampras and Andre Agassi were worthy adversaries. The political adversaries tried to stop him from growing in popularity. Affable, easy and pleasant to talk to. An affable smile. Affinity, a natural attraction, a natural inclination towards something. He felt a strong affinity for that girl. Alacrity, promptness, the quickness with which something is being done. He accepted the invitation with alacrity. To alienate means to do something to become unfriendly to do something that would make other people hostile to estrain someone if you keep shouting at your friends you will end up alienating your friends alienating your supporters altercation is a heated discussion alter means other you and uh, some other person have other opinions or different opinions Hence, there is a heated discussion that's an altercation. Analogous, similar to, equivalent to in some respect. Brains and computers are often considered to be analogous. Anathema is a curse or a detested person could also be an anathema. Anomaly, deviation from normal. The rings alone around the planet were an anomaly because it was not expected. Arbitrary, determined by chance, 
whim or impulse it is not determined by reason synonyms would be whimsical capricious so you go into a hotel you see some five stars there and you want to buy it it's an arbitrary decision to buy the chocolate it was not pre planned or thought about logically and so on you just felt like it at that moment and you bought it as an arbitrary or a whimsical capricious whimsical also comes from whim which means what you think at a particular moment capricious comes from caprice again something similar aswaj to make something less intense or severe to aswaj a grief baffle to confuse or to frustrate to flummox to perplex intrepid trepid means fearful trepidation means full of fear intrepid means fearless in here means the opposite of intrepid fighters intrepid soldiers while trepidation means fear he had to spend the night alone near the mortuary and he was filled with trepidation fiasco a complete failure the cultural program which was organized was a fiasco nothing went right confiscate to take something without permission or consent especially by a public authority so the government confiscated uh, their house because they had not paid some tax and they had cheated on something censure harsh criticism baleful means portending evil ominous sinister banal common place trite hackneyed banal remarks means very common remarks virtuoso a highly skilled artist village means to plunder the decoits pillage the village vouchsafe means to guarantee i cannot vouchsafe anything which means i cannot guarantee anything wary means cautious be aware of dogs be cautious about dogs be wary of dogs valor exceptional or heroic courage especially when facing danger in the battle or in any place if you look at the film the man with the iron mask you would notice that three people instead of surrendering meekly would decide to fight a huge contingent of people armed with guns they showed exceptional valor vilify to spread negative information about someone when you vilify someone you spoil the reputation of this, of that person by saying something bad about that person which is not true unkempt not properly maintained or not neatly combed unkempt hair akin similar or related to eating food cooked by her is akin to eating poison cadaverous cadaverous comes from cadaver which means a dead body a cadaverous means pale and thin like a dead body if you notice people who have come from nazi camps many of them were so thin that they could be aptly described as cadaverous debilitate to make weak to enfeeble the life in the nazi camp debilitated the people there dire tribe angry and bitter criticism this is sri ganesh from dream chasers 9944365111 www.dreamchasersindia.com we are continuing with session 3 part 1 revocable that can be taken back irrevocable that cannot be taken back words are irrevocable miasma unhealthy atmosphere when you enter the room of some people in the hostel that room will be filled by cigarette smoke so you can say that it's a miasma of cigarette smoke hide bound narrow mindedness asperity being harsh or severe especially in the way you talk there was asperity in his tone citation reference so when you want to refer to some text from which some passage has been taken you cite that source you refer to that source circuitous roundabout cutus root is roundabout root clandestine secret clandestine love affairs cliche c l i c h e something that is very common in tamil films the sentence i love you is has become a cliche almost every film has it astute shrewd a person 
who is astute is a person who knows what to do and gets things done an astute businessman is a shrewd businessman attenuate to make thin to reduce in force or value be little is to disparage someone to spoil the name of someone by saying something bad about him be little my efforts don't be little me in front of my friends benign kind is one meaning benignant means kind benign in medicine means something that is not dangerous benign form of tumor malignant is very dangerous a malignant tumor is tumor that might lead to very serious consequences bestial like a beast bestial characters of man are exemplified by criminals in prison bizarre eccentric not normal b i z a r r e capacious having high capacity a capacious room capricious comes from capris whimsical which means doing something that you think at that particular point of time castigate punish with blows or words to chastise hi this is sri ganesh from dream chasers www.dreamchasersindia.com 9941436511 we are looking at session 3 part 2 commiserate to sympathize it's a formal way of expressing sympathy so when uh, india and australia play and australia loses the indian captain might just say my commiserations are with you it's just a formal way of expressing sympathy congenital gen means origin or birth con means together so congenital means occurring from birth uh, only karna was born with uh, divine earrings and uh, uh, unbreakable coat on his chest for all others we generally use congenital defects and so on consanguinous sanguine means blood consanguinous means related together by blood blood related consanguinous marriages might lead to congenital defects crux the most important point dauntless fearless daunting task would be something that causes fear dauntless means fearless debacle sudden collapse debilitate make somebody weak enfeeble decimate to decimate means to destroy the opponents earlier decimate used to mean uh, killing one tenth of the people now it means destroying a large part of the plague decimated the population in the city deleterious harmful inimical detrimental smoking is deleterious to one's health detrimental to one's health inimical to one's health deluge means flood there was a deluge of chinese goods in the market inundate also means the same thing to flood denigrate d e n i g r a t e means to defame to blacken deranged crazy a deranged stephigraph fan went and st- stabbed monica celes desecrate to deprive the sacred character of the opposite is to consecrate wearing slippers inside a temple desecrates the temple while when the pontiff of a religion comes and does uh, the uh, puja it is supposed to consecrate uh, the temple morally contemptible something that's very bad a despicable behavior destitute without resources in great need of something say food when you say a person is destitute he is very poor disconsolate that cannot be consoled inconsolable forlorn desperate the death of her father made her disconsolate divulge reveal don't divulge whatever i said dogmatic stubborn highly opinionated to become weak to lose energy on we e n n u i boredom reason for the on we in the classroom is because of the way it is being taught ephemeral hemera means a day so ephemeral means lasting for a day or lasting for a very short period of time fleeting transient ephemeral pleasures 
erudite an erudite professor fulminate to utter or say something like thunder very strongly furtive stealthy he looked at her furtively relevant or pertinent to the matter is this germane to our discussion gist the central meaning or theme of any speech or work what is the gist of this passage gratuitous given freely gratuitous advice halcyon calm and peaceful halcyon uh, comes from greek mythology it refers to a bird which has the ability to calm even the oceans by its singing the halcyon days of childhood refers to the calm and peaceful days of childhood hirsute harry having a lot of hair and hirsute animal hybrid something that is got as a mixture of two or more different things offer as a sacrifice immutable changeless that cannot be changed impeccable peca means fault impeccable means faultless peccadillos are minor faults impecunious poor impecunious person is a poor person to pester or to beg continuously inane stupid or silly inane remarks impromptu means without preparation an impromptu dance incarcerate means to imprison to lock up in jail inclement not pleasant without mercy inclement weather clemency means mercy inept graceless not elegant incompetent someone who is not good at doing something he is inept at something inimical hostile not friendly harmful inimical stares innocuous harmless innocuous remarks with this we complete session 3 this is sri ganesh from dream chasers www.dreamchasersindia.com 9941436511 if you found this useful please send me a small thank you mail to vr dream chasers at gmail dot com V for victory so it's V R D R E A M C H A S E R S at gmail dot com keep working hard knowledge is the ultimate competitive advantage thank you.